Hey, oh, there's Doug, the homeowner here. Hey guys. Hey. So, uh, Doug, as I as I mentioned to you here, we've uh, we've taken a video of this whole beautiful interior remodel and exterior, for that matter. So, people always want to know: Are people happy with Golden Gate Enterprises? Are they happy with the guys that do the work? And you know, how did your house start out, and how did it end up? So, if you were talking to a friend or family, what would you tell them about? your whole experience in working with Golden Gate and this whole remodel process. Yeah, the experience was pretty good from start to finish. Um, started out by just giving Paul a call. And, um, that actually started off, by the way, by, by these videos too. So, you know, um, did what everybody else does. You know, checked online for, you know, different contractors and stuff. Uh, what drew me to Paul was the videos and stuff, but actually seeing the work, you know, as it was being done and the progress and stuff like that. So gave him a call and uh, he came over to the house and at that time, man, our house was uh, way what, what year is this house, the original this house? This is uh, 1954. So it was, a, it was an old house all the yeah, way around. Yeah, yeah it was. Um, pretty much um, previous owners, uh, you know, did some, some stuff to it, but um, I don't know. We just uh, decided, you know, go for it and gave Paul a call and uh, next thing you know, it came out. And uh, we discussed the job and what could be done and uh, went from there. Um, How was your experience in dealing with, you know, myself and the guys doing the work and the whole process? I mean, what's your, yeah, you know, because yeah. you, you hear all the nightmare stories of working with contractors and we, we like to think we end up on a good note and, <laughs> and friends with people that oh, do the work. Absolutely, man. See, that, that's what I was going to talk about next was the crew. See, I, after you talk to Paul, you know, you guys get a game plan and everything, you know, work things out. Then, you know, once the job starts, you meet the crew. Steve comes over and Steve, he, he's, your, he's your guy, right? He's your go-to guy right there. Communication is, is, is on a daily basis was good. Um, went over everything. Uh, Felipe, man, that dude, he's a pro, okay? He, he's, I, I got nothing but good things to say about him. Yep. So Steve, Felipe, Danny, the painter, and the rest of the crew, unbelievable. Yep. Unbelievable. Um, one thing I will say too, though, um, things come up on every job no matter what. And what I got, um, what we felt as a family was that Steve, Paul, always had the, our best interests. And they always uh, looked out for us and, you know, suggested things here and there. And it, it, was, it was a collaborative process. And it was, well, it was you, really you bring up an interesting point because I do explain that to people that, you know, you can do all the planning you want, but until you start yeah, doing yeah. the job, then you start zigging and zagging. And especially, oh, sorry, especially if you're like us and have no idea what you wanted to do in the first place. And, you know, going through, you know, you start throwing stuff out there like, hey, what about this? What about that? And the guys are really flexible too, and they could adjust. And as long as you can think it up, they, they can do it. it it's, would you say it's a fair statement? Because this is what I explained to people, and I may have even told you this when, before we got started, that when we get going, the feedback that you'll always get from us is as if it were our own house, yeah, right? Well, absolutely, yeah, yeah. So we're trying to keep you out of trouble, and yeah. you know we want a nice looking job because we want you to be happy, and we do a lot of these, so we try and, you know, my guys, you and I can talk all we want, my guys are here, they're going, well, that's great, Paul, that said that, but you know what? You should really be looking at this because of this, and you probably heard that yeah. a dozen times from absolutely. Steve or the guys, right? Yeah. Good. Really good. So, would you recommend Golden Gate and our crew to friends, family, all that kind of stuff? Yeah, but before we recommend them, though, we might want to have you guys come back and do some more house <laughs> first, though. You know, there's still some more things we want to have done in the future, but uh, we'll talk about that later. Well, um, Doug, yeah, Doug it's though, family, friends, anybody out there, if you guys watching this, give them a call. They're really top-notch people. Um, I got nothing but good things to say. So. so you, you want you want to show off your uh, your new kitchen here yeah, quickly? So, I mean, this kitchen before was just tiny kitchen. Um, these guys opened up the, the wall for us, recessed beam up, pocketed the beam up there, which just made this room here just so open and inviting, really. Um, my wife picked out this ring shirt, amazing. It's it just it's perfect. Uh, we got some stainless steel appliances here. Um, kids love this uh, microwave right here. So they've got to, they've got to get over playing with it, but absolutely, absolutely. But, but these are these are pretty nice. Really they easy. they get rid of the ugly microwave on the counter or taking yeah. up a big shelf exactly. space. Now exactly. it looks like a nice clean modern appliance. Yeah. Um, ZMC cabinets, um, custom cabinets right there. 
this uh, oh, garden window. See, once we got the garden window installed, we were just like, man, we gotta have something that just shows off that window right there. So we went ahead and got this Kohler uh, faucet right here. And this thing, I, I love this faucet here. But it, it just, it's another focal point over here. It just brings more attention. Yeah, yeah the garden window really, it looks nice. It yeah. makes the space feel even bigger because it projects out. Absolutely. And your, your selection of the mosaic tile complements all of this really, really nicely. Yeah, that backsplash is, is unbelievable. Um, Steve tiled that, did a um, tile on the ground on that. He did a hell of a job. He actually picked out the color of the ground too, which blended right in and it was just perfect. So, you know, even if you don't know exactly, you know, what type of uh, choices you want, um, they have good recommendations for you and stuff like that. And uh, ultimately it's up for you to decide as a customer, but the recommendations are awesome, man. Cool. Can't complain about nothing. Um, and, I, and I think this was what, the San Francisco Fog, the color? Yeah, San yeah. Francisco Fog uh, for the main walls. Uh, we did a Pebble Beach color. Uh, Accent wall inside the bedrooms, um, Swiss coffee on the baseboards and on all the trim, um, acacia hardwood floor, um, our countertops. Uh, we went with the uh, white Carrera countertops, uh, quartz. Yep, and this is with the nice waterfall down the side. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's a wonderful touch right there, too, the waterfall on the side. Yeah, normally you'd be looking at maybe a wood panel, which looks nice, but this looks like this. A thousand percent nicer, more sophisticated. Absolutely. It really has punch to it. Pretty so if you if you look at this, you know now here's what you're looking at as a finished island. I mean, it's really pretty nice. So yeah. you get a couple of the right you know stools up here. You got a countertop, and you know this is where it's all going to be happening for Doug and his family in the uh, the new yeah. great room here. Yeah. You know, you guys got you know, hey, modern times right now. You know, kids come home, they just want to throw their bags on the floor, eat. And do homework right away if you're, you know, your yep. parents, right? Yep. So this is a good spot for the kids to come down, lay their stuff down, grab a snack, and do some homework right here on the counter You know? That's a good point. So everybody's always, still here. and Everybody's always on the go. Yep, 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 right. yep. Um, and uh, your your bathroom just came out incredible. I love this uh, uh, tile that's in the hallway bathroom. Um, so, and the, both the bathrooms have the, uh, the, li the linear drain. So how did you guys end up deciding on this particular tile? Was that you or your wife that picked this out? Uh, she did this room right here. Uh, she picked out the subway tile for the, uh, the walls right there. She picked out the accent tile. Um, and then the floor tile we both decided on because we put it in both of the um, bathrooms. But I, that's... That, tile right there it speaks for itself right there. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's incredible i like the profile of it and uh i know this is a new experience for you but how do you ha how do you like these curbless linear drain you know bathrooms yeah. there it gets i mean so it gets rid of the whole curb we have a fam we have our family here we also have our in-laws with us so one of the things that we did here for them was we took out the bathtub that was here so they don't have to step over to get into the shower yeah as people age it's, it's, it's a really good thing for you know for older people to be able to, to just walk straight into a shower without having to step over, you know, maybe, you know, slip and fall and stuff. So the other good thing in here too, is we also got a bench with a shower wand over here for, you know, people to use, which is a really nice, uh, nice touch. Um, so the, these are good for two things. One, if you have anybody, an older person, otherwise you get a, you can sit down, you got a yeah, place to kind of catch yourself in the, in the shower. And then the other thing is, uh, you and I can't hundred percent relate to it, but women like to go ahead and put their leg up and, uh, yeah, and shave, yeah, right? Yeah, otherwise, absolutely. you know, I've literally seen, you know, women bring a little stool into the shower, yeah. you know, cause otherwise how else are they going to hold their leg up? Yeah. <laughs> now one more thing too, that we absolutely love about this, this bathroom here, that, that Paulson 